Then he isn't in Philadelphia. No. And that's why he didn't meet me at the boat. Yeah. Oh, but it can't be serious. You don't think it's serious, do you? I'm afraid I do, dear. Here are the last three letters you wrote him. Well, he never even opened them. What's she like? I've never even seen her. Well, I have. And believe me, she's bad medicine. One of those blondes with a mother. They hunt together. What the gal shoots down, Mama drags home. Make no mistake about it, Nancy. Don is hooked, good and plenty. And in a way, it's mostly your fault. My fault? Why, all I've ever done is love him. You left him, didn't you? Didn't you? Well, I had to. You know I did. A wife should stick to her husband. If she doesn't, some other woman will. Oh, but Don's never been like that. All men are like that. You marry him, you put him in cages, you lock him up every night, and you say, oh, see my nice, tame husband. But you just leave him for a little while, and you see what happens? Well, what does happen? Peggy Preston. And your nice, tame husband isn't tame anymore, he's wild. And you either get him back in that cage, or you lose him. I'm afraid you've lost him, Nancy. Don wants to marry Peggy. Marry her? Why, he can't marry her. How can he? Don wants you to divorce him, dear. Oh, so that's it. Well, I won't do it. You can tell him so for me. I'm not turning him over to the first woman who flatters him and makes him feel important. You'll never hold him that way. I don't want to hold him. Good, I don't blame you. I don't want him. But I'll never let her have him. <laughs> never. <laughs> oh. I'm sorry, dear, really. But if you want him that bad, there's only one thing for you to do. You've got to play Peggy's game. I don't want to play any game. What is her game? Simple. You shower Don with love. Peggy's smart. She makes him reach for it. What is it, Brooks? Mr. Gibson has just driven in. 